Welcome to NAB 2017. It's the processing guys. Hi, Jeff. Hi, Mike. How are you? How are you doing? Good. We've been busy. You've been busy? Nah. You haven't been busy? Nah, I haven't done a thing in years. All right, so what the heck is this? Um, you know, this thing. That was an accident, actually. This was an accident? It was a, it was a late night. It was a hot date. And a lot, next, of, lot of beer. Next thing we knew, we had an Aurora X4. It, it was born. So, Aurora X4, what does it do that you want it so bad that you're just going to just stop this video right here and go out and get it? Well, it's got an insert point, which is cool because a lot of processors have claimed they have insert points before, but you kind of needed to hang some external equipment on the processor in order to get that insert point to work. It's Yeah, it's not a good idea to need an extra box just when you need an insert point. Right. So it's simple. We built it in. Yeah, just right there. It also has time alignment. Now, okay, we've done time alignment with X3, we do time alignment with X1, but how many processors do you know have an FM and HD tuner built in? Only X4. X4 has it. Right here, it does the time alignment automatically. It does all the math for you, you don't have to worry about a darn thing. Just put it in and you can go to sleep with peaceful HD dreams. Sorry. I can't think of any peaceful HD dreams, I'm sorry. I, all that nice audio playing nicely on your radio and you know that if reception gets bad, it'll just fall right back to analog and you won't even know it. That's true. So, okay, X4, he speaks the truth. X4 also has complete time aligned, a phase linear, uh, processing from end to end, and we believe that's the first time that's ever been done in an audio processor. Yeah, we had the uh, resources to do basically phase linear processing through the entire box. And uh, what that means is basically absolute audio purity as far as getting through any frequency division stages like crossovers. Uh, and uh, that allows the user to basically dial in the sound he wants without having a sound he can't escape from to start with. For everyone else, that means it sounds good. <laughs> Actually, it sounds damn good. It sounds damn good. Can I say damn on the radio? You just did. Okay. In fact, uh, we said it twice. The last thing it's got is we've um, we bought over some of the uh, features that have made Wheatstone Processing famous, including our multipath mitigation, which uh, works very well. It does. And has been proven in multiple markets, including our recent article from our friend Scotty Rice in San Diego. Denver, New York, it's been on a bunch of places and it's, it's helped broadcasters uh, overcome multipath issues uh, legitimately without uh, distorting the composite domain in a way that makes radios behave badly. And it's always been a surprise because you walk into a facility and you've got this trick under your arm and they say, well, that's impossible. And then you put it on the air and you take them out in the car and you show them and they're like, how did you do that? It's been a long time since I've had a trick under my arm. Anyway. <laughs> So this is X4, and besides this horrible comedy routine, because we're all kind of punchy just getting through NAB, we'd love you to come and hear it if you see this video before um, we finish the show here. If you haven't seen this video, you want to get on the phone and call us, call BSW, call uh, uh, SCMS and anyone else who uh, sells lovely X4 and Wheatstone audio processors, and uh, we want you to get an X4, we want smiles. Remember, live long and process.